Hi everybody, my name is David and this is the Cartoon Fortress YouTube channel where we talk films and film collecting. I'm really excited to bring you an unboxing of a set from Kino Lorber that I am very, very excited about. In fact, if I could point you to a YouTube channel uh, that really dives into this set, uh, that would be Daisuke Beppu's uh, YouTube channel. He dives into this set and goes over each of the films and gives really great insight and analysis on each of the films and and uh, is just really a wonderful series of videos. So the set that I'm talking about uh, again comes to us from Kino Lorber. This is part of their Kino Classics line and this is actually from uh, the Library of Congress and this is Pioneers of African American Cinema. So there is the cover, so just a really, really great looking overall set. There's the spine, there's the back, and on the inside you can see here we get a case where the discs are housed, and then uh, we get a really wonderful booklet, a decent sized book in there. Um, so there's a quote from Martin Scorsese here on the cover that says, this very special collection illuminates one of the most fascinating and unjustly neglected corners of American movie history. And that's really what I love about this set and about sets like this, is that we get to take a look at films that are maybe less talked about, um, different film movements and filmmakers that have not gotten their uh, the, the attention on their work that that really is deserved and so this is a set that I, I really was excited to jump on and so uh, just to give you an idea of what's included here so this box set uh, in, in terms of the the years that these films were released uh, covers 1915 through 1946 so just over 30 years of filmmaking, and I'm trying to see too here if I can get a, a total runtime, um, and I don't seem to see that here. Uh, no, I do. Uh, total runtime is approximately 1,266 minutes. Um, so just a, a plethora of content here. And I have to say, I picked up this set on Amazon. Usually I buy direct through Kino, um, but I bought on Amazon, and I believe this was one of the sets that I got as a part of their uh, buy two, get one, uh, get one free sale. And I wanna say that I paid $35 for this, which is just criminally low. Uh, for all of the content that you get here. I know it's going to be a bit more expensive on the Kino Lorber site. Um, in fact, at time of filming this video, I believe on the Kino Lorber site, it's about $75, which I think is still worth it, to be quite honest. But I was really, really pleased uh, to get this at, at such a, a bargain price. Now, just to give an idea of what's included here, so we have a five-disc collection 19 digitally restored feature films, short films, fragments, documentaries, and then the booklet included is 80 pages, and that has essays and photos, and then we have interviews with historians and archivists, musical scores by DJ Spooky, Max Roach, Samuel Wayman, Donald uh, Sosen, and more, includes bonus content not available on DVD. So there is, and I think what they're referring to maybe is, because there is a, D a DVD counterpart, um, this is the Blu-ray set, um, but the, the DVD set, it looks like maybe doesn't include um, all of the bonus content that's included here on the Blu-ray set. Um, so I just wanna go over the films that are included here, um, but even the list here, I don't think is exhaustive because it says, and more at the bottom. Um, but we have Birthright from 1938, The Blood of Jesus from 1941, 
Body and Soul from 1925, The Bronze Buckaroo from 1939, The Rite of Birth, uh, which it looks like we don't have the, the full film on that, it's a fragment, uh, from 1921, Commandment Keeper Church, Beaufort, South Carolina from 1940, The Dark Town Review from 1931, Dirty Gertie from Harlem, USA from 1946, 11 p.m. from 1928, The Exile from 1931, The Flying Ace from 1926, Hellbound Train from 1930, Hot Biscuits from 1931, The Scar of Shame from 1929, The Symbol of the Unconquered from 1920, 10 Minutes to Live from 1932, 10 Nights in a Bar Room from 1926, Two Nights of Vaudeville from 1915, Veiled Aristocrats from 1932, We Work Again from 1937, and Within Our Gates from 1920, and more, as it states on this set. So just an amazing amount of content here. I still can't believe that I got this for 35 bucks. I mean, it's just uh, uh, just an amazing deal for this set. And I'd like to take you further than just talking about the uh, what's included here. I actually wanna show you on the inside of the set um, so that you know what to expect if this is something that you wanna purchase. So we'll go ahead and switch over to the other camera and do that now. Okay, so here is our beautiful set from Kino Lorber for Pioneers of African American Cinema. Let me go ahead and pull off the shrink wrap here so we can take a look on the inside here without the glare of the shrink wrap. So I really like the design on here. This font, the lettering is really, really cool looking and just gives a great feel for the uh, for the era of these films. And here's a closer look at the back. Go ahead and feel free to pause if you'd like to read over these more in detail. Um, but you can see here just a completely packed set. Um, and if you're interested, here's the technical information on the bottom. And there's the sides. So let's go ahead and pull the contents out here and take a look. I will set our box to the side and I'll also set the booklet to the side. Um, so let's actually flip this over this way. So here we have the set. So this opens up and the discs are just in this tray like this. Um, so we have a little bit of disc stacking, if you want to call it that. They're not stacked directly on one another, but um, yeah, a little bit of stacking nonetheless, kind of dovetailing, I guess, a little bit. So there is the discs, and I won't show you each of the discs as they are just the same standard color. Um, so we'll go ahead and put these back and I love the art uh, behind the discs as well. So there's oops, disc three and disc four. The art behind there. And finally Uh, we've got disc five uh, with the artwork for Birthright behind there. And if we flip this over, so there's a list of selected contents. Just move this across, so really great presentation here. Some quotes from Martin Scorsese and Ashley Clark of The Guardian. This 
So that is how the disks themselves are housed. We'll go ahead and set this here. And then we have this uh, really nice perfect bound book that's included as well. So we have Pioneers of African American Cinema, including essays by Charles Musser, Jacqueline uh, Najuma Stewart. And then we have uh, film, uh, film notes. So we have film form, film function, race cinema and the color line, race movies, a patchwork history, a special discovery, Pearl Bowser and the Moses sisters, Reverend Solomon Sir Jones, Capturing Progress in Black Oklahoma, 1924 through 1928 by Mary N. Elliott. And then we have Special Thanks, Filmography, and uh, some suggested reading, which is really great. So just to give you an idea of the format of the book inside, so lots of great reading, photographs and little snippets. Some poster art, so I'm really excited to dive into the reading. In fact, let's back up here a little bit. Um, so here we have a filmography, which is really cool. So information on, so it acts as basically a little episode guide, which is really great with run times and uh, cast and crew information. And then here we have uh, suggested reading. So there is a large list of books here uh, for suggested reading, which is really, really great. And then we have a picture here of the gym theater. All right, so that is the booklet that's included. Um, so just a really beautiful overall set here from Kino Lorber for Pioneers of African American Cinema. All right, everybody, thank you so much for taking time out of your day to come by the channel and watch this video. I hope you did enjoy it. I'm really impressed by this set from Kino Lorber and cannot wait to dive in and watch all of these films. Again, if you are interested in learning more about the films in this set, I can't recommend Daisuke Beppu's channel highly enough. I'll go ahead and include a link for his channel in, in the description, as well as a link that you can purchase this set if that is something that you're interested in. And if you are new to this channel and you found this video helpful or entertaining in any way and would like to subscribe, I do invite you to hit that subscribe button also the like button and finally the bell icon that will notify you when I upload new videos in the future and until next time my name is David and I hope you have a wonderful day.